Okay, we're here at um, a rather wet uh, Davos, and I'm with uh, the two co-chairs of the WEF CEO Alliance of Climate Leaders. And first, uh, I just want to ask uh, Jesper Brodin, can you just tell us a bit about the Alliance? So basically, the Alliance is uh, today 120 companies. Um, uh, it's an alliance that has grown rapidly the last years, last year with 40%. And we are together, even if it's only 120 companies, these companies together, represent a carbon footprint and a responsibility that actually matches uh, the third biggest nation on this planet. So it is a, uh, basically a collaboration between companies who have decided to be leaders when it comes to combating uh, climate change. Okay, thank you. And now Christian, over to you as the, uh, the fellow co-chair. I wonder if you had a, a sense of the, uh, the mood in, uh, in Davos. Yeah, I was positively surprised because uh, I feared that because of uh, all the current crisis we have, the, the war in Ukraine, uh, you know, all, all the issues we see on the economic front, that uh, nobody would talk about climate. But I'm really happy to see that climate is still totally on the agenda. We had many, many meetings, more than ever before, and I feel the engagement is actually stronger than ever before. So that's really good news from that perspective. Mm. Okay, great. Thank you very much. And I think the thing everyone wants to know then is uh, what about the actions, are there actions taking place in this alliance? Well, I would say a few years ago we were, uh, I think we were less uh, into the topic, less knowledgeable, less updated, less uh, well planned. Um, but we have together as an alliance actually passed the stage of understanding the crisis, uh, committing to Paris. And now we are moving into exactly what you're asking, the actions and the solutions. So the discussions that we have been partaking in is, of course, both the excellent solutions that are being put in place, but also the dilemmas and the things that we need to combat together. Okay, thank you. So I know uh, both of you are uh, leaving soon, uh, Davos, but um, what's going to happen next? Yeah, so in terms of next steps, we have uh, three pillars. So the first one is commit. So we try to get more companies on board. We grew 40% uh, you know, last year. And so it's important to have more companies who commit to this net zero 2050. Uh, the second pillar is around uh, actions, and, and Jesper talked about some of those. So it's really actions across the value chain where we try to help each other to decarbonize the value chain. And the third one is uh, engage. So engaging also with uh, the external world, governments, etc. So part of what we discussed is we will have to show up at the COP27 in, in Egypt to, to show that business is engaged and uh, not all business is against what is being happened, but more and more business knows the challenge and is willing to engage and is willing to do our part. Gentlemen, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.